What's going on YouTube and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am here with the first video for EA FC 24 or as it is known as FIFA 24. On this video I'm gonna make a tutorial video for the 424 formation. So here we go guys I've got my team and it is Real Madrid and the first thing that you should do is go to the formation. So here we go guys uh, we have got a point now the 424 formation and here it is so before taking the 424 formation if you are in a ultimate team or kickoff for example in ultimate team you're gonna need a fast left winger and a fast right winger as well and of course two good strikers and you are gonna need a good center defensive midfielder and a good center midfielder so one of the midfielders uh, should have high ability also in the family so after you do that go to the instructions when you come to the instructions you have got the left winger over here and the right winger these two players have got the same instructions and they go like this for example defensive support goes to stay forward which means that the player will not come back to defend anymore this way he is gonna save a lot of stamina and he is gonna be ready to counterattack any time uh, the chance of creation uh, leave it cut inside because you are gonna need uh, this player to come from the wide area uh, and run to the center area so the support run is uh, getting behind so the player will run behind the opponent defense and the support on crosses if he has got good header make him get into the box for cross but for Vinicius Jr case make him stay on edge of the box for cross the interception just leave it normal uh, the striker is gonna be stay central it means that the player will stay on the center of the area of the pitch so he's not gonna make some uh, wide runs uh, attacking runs is gonna be getting behind interception normal defensive support also stay forward the same thing for the second striker stay central getting behind normal interception and stay forward so the players are not on their respective positions but on the end of the video i'm gonna show you a bonus tip on how to position the real madrid players for this formation after you do these instructions go to the right winger the same thing stay forward cut inside get in behind and normal interception and this one it depends on your player's heading ability now for the two center midfielders we have got over here uh, Bellingham and Cross. for example Bellingham is gonna be a cover center you don't need to cover wing because you already have got a left back and a left winger so this way making cover center and support on crosses it depends and attacking support just making balanced attack the other guy is gonna be stay back while attacking, support on cross balance of crossing rounds, normal interception and cover center. The right back stay back while attacking and the left back stay back while attacking as well. This way you are gonna have 4 players that are gonna constantly attack, whereas a player is gonna go forward and come back to defend. And this one is gonna stay back, uh, right back and the left back is gonna stay back. So it means that now we have got like five players that are gonna defend and a center midfielder which goes forward and comes back to defend. So it's like a joker and four players that are gonna constantly attack. So yeah, these are the instructions and for the tactics, uh, defensive style should be drop back because uh, this formation is a rescue one. So if you are not good defending, just leave it drop back. So you don't concede false counter-attack goals. Team width is going to be 50%, 60 uh, depth, uh, build up play is going to be false build up, direct passing. 50 with uh, players in box like 3, corners 1 and free kicks 1. The reason that I leave it 1 and 1 on corners and free kicks is because most of the times we make uh, mistakes on free kicks or corners and we concede silly counter attack goals. So for the bonus tip for Real Madrid on how to position the players, you have got over here uh, Modric for example instead of Bellingham uh, with Tony Cross over here. 
the defenders are very good except the goalkeeper the goalkeeper should be changed so Lunin instead of Courtois and we have got a striker here yeah Jose Lu for example instead of Kamavinga uh, so yeah this is the best lineup that you can come with Real Madrid so Valverde as a right winger and uh, left winger Vini Jr. and two strikers Jose Lu and Rodrigo cross Modric so yeah this is the best uh, lineup possible for Real Madrid.